Today I'm going to show you how to make 10 8 ounce bottles of goat milk lotion. Um, this is where we'll put our final product. First thing you want to do is sanitize everything. I put a little, about a tablespoon or so of bleach and some water and then all my gadgets. I'm going to use my measuring cups and spoons and my stick blender and I just dip it in it and rinse it off. The ingredients I'm going to use, uh, first I'll take some almond oil, avocado oil, stearic acid, and emulsifying wax, and I'll melt that in um, a, a Pyrex cup in the, um, or a measuring cup in the um, microwave. Then I'll melt in a little shea butter. Then I will add about a quart of um, goat milk, quart of water, and I'll mix it with my stick blender. And then I'll add, uh, this is Pheno Nip, it's a preservative. And then today I'm going to do oat milk and honey just because I like that, that fragrance. Um, I get my products, some I get at the grocery store, some I get off Amazon, and, and some I order off Brambleberry. So it's a, it's a variety of places. Um, so here I have my measuring cup I'm going to put in the microwave. I've got um, my sweet almond oil in here. And then here I have my um, avocado oil. Um, this is my stearic acid. And then this is my shea butter. And then this is my emulsifying wax. So now I'm going to mix these together and start heating in the microwave. Okay, I've heated the almond oil, the avocado, and the stearic acid. I did that for three minutes in my microwave. And now I'm going to add the emulsifying wax and start heating again. Okay, so I've heated up my milk. I heat it in water mixture. I heated that for about five minutes. This is my um, avocado, sweet almond, stearic acid, emulsifying wax, shea butter mixture. Um, and how I did that, I heated it up for about two minutes, um, stirred it, and then slowly added the other ingredients. I uh, did the almond oil, avocado oil, and stearic acid for two minutes, stirred it, microwaved it another minute, then I added the emulsifying wax and did it for another two minutes, and then I just um, stirred it and, and the shea butter automatically melted in. Now I'm going to put these two items together and um, add the pheno nip and the scent and I'm going to use my mixer to mix it up. So now I'm mixing this. I've got it on about a medium speed. Um, as it cools it will, will thicken. Um, but you don't want to go too long because as it cools, it's going to be harder to pour. So you just want to do it until you pull all your ingredients so it looks like it's all consistently one color and you've gotten all the oil mixed in with the uh, water and, and goat milk. And then I'm going to take this gadget and put it over my lotion bottle. And that's it. Stop. And there's the finished product.